Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Deus Ex The Invisible War. And now I wager that JC will probably be stuck in my head forever. But hey, we do now finally have a rocket launcher. Which is fantastic. Hey, <laughs> it's big and explodey. Excellent. But, uh, not for now, though. For now, we're probably just gonna leave. Head back to Cairo. We are completely out of bioelectric energy. I can't solve that, uh, But first... No, not that. I think I, I, think I use a uh, medkit. And then, I'll fully restore my bioelectric power. Nice. Okay, somewhere through here... There is a Versalife region. Also, there should be some more ammo scattered everywhere. I need that. I've kind of used a lot. And that's what happens when you're... Okay, abandoned Versalife base exterior. That's where I want to go. So, one moment. Well, we're back here. Hopefully this place is now not massively full of troops. Because, um, I don't really want it to be massively full of troops. Perhaps I didn't even... Well, I wasn't required to come here until I, um, had found JC, but it would seem like everybody is still dead. Or unconscious. You're unconscious. So let's just make our way back, shall we? Hmm. Power generator... Helipad's probably nearby. Trespassers will indeed be prosecuted. It's nice to know. Helipad this way. Okay. Can I activate the beacon from up here? B-Wing. Mm, probably. Maybe? What is my objective currently? No. Meet Ava Johnson as helicopter outside the abandoned Versalife base. Well, <coughs> it should be here. I don't see why it's not. Do I need to activate the beacon? Why would I activate such a thing anyway? I'll take that though. Should be here. But then again, stranger things have happened in this game, so. Oh, hello. Yeah, you're at full health. Ooh. Have you seen that thing? Was nah, like we've already seen that. Maybe I'm starting to lose my mind. You're not starting to lose your mind, don't worry. No, no. I only need to go up here, apparently. She should be here. And yet, she's not. Hmm. The generator is indeed working. So what am I missing? Well, there's a water cooler. It appears to be empty. Is there ammo up here? Hey, a bit of ammo. Always good. Hmm. I get the feeling she should be here, waiting for me. Perhaps I'm wrong. Well, give me a moment and I'll figure this out. Because I don't want to do this and, uh not find the helicopter, so one moment. I'm being silly. I haven't activated the pilot beacon. That's a rather imp Ow. I need to activate the pilot beacon before I can receive a message to actually get the helicopter here. And the pilot beacon was a building that I said was not the helipad, which indeed is correct. Which is this building, but it will summon the helicopter. Hey, there we go. Okay. You're probably gonna land on the helipad, you 
don't need to tell me to stand and clear. I'm going to be miles away from you. There you are. Hello. And then we can travel to Cairo. Again. Also, I'm now at getting close to full ammo, which is also good. Let's save here, just in case something goes horribly wrong. Hello. Hey, Ava. Okay. How will JC get there? JC Denton is already there, in a manner of speaking. Oh, lovely. Preparing the systems necessary for the great advance while we are in Cairo. Advance? Hmm. JC does not use the word advance. This notion is present in my original programming, as constructed by Tracer Tong in the 2040s. Oh. What good are socio-political notions to a pilot drone? Good you point. Have to ask Mr. Tong. Shall we go? Yes, we shall go. One moment. Ava warned me to get some rest, and this place was not as friendly as when I first came here. That's not a good sign. Is it going to be full of death? The Templars have overrun all of New Cairo. Oh, the Moss. lovely. They have moved Paul Denton's cryo storage tank to flight B-24 ah. on the 110 of the Arcology. There again. What do you know about the Templar defenses? Lovely. They have deployed a military bot in the mosque and two in the arcology. What happened to the city's security forces? Hmm. They were eliminated. SSC Chief Farah Maxwell stormed the arcology with forces flown in from Germany, but they were surrounded and are now pinned down somewhere inside we'll the We'll have structure. to help them. So I'm on my own. I will wait here for now. After you find Paul, I will meet you in Flight B-23 at the top of the arcology. Good luck. This is what the Illuminati wants you to do. Destroy Paul Denton and help return Biomod technology to international regulation. Please discuss the operation with the elite commando waiting for you in the street. Paul's frozen body is located in Flight Bay 24, level 110 of the Alka. Now everybody starts playing their hands, do they? I don't want to start telling me to do this, do that, do the other. Well, I've got my own objectives. Besides, you'll find later it doesn't matter what I do in some of it. Gotta go at it this way, do I? Okay. <laughs> this way? There. Where is he? There he is. Hey Sid, how's it going? I figured you'd knock around Europe for a while. You do know that the Medina could get overrun by Templars at any moment. Yup. Thought there might be some trade in refugees. You know, quick hops away from trouble. But there hasn't been enough action yet for people to start liking my rates. What about you? I can take care of myself, but I might have use for a pilot later. Hmm. Long trip, one way to New York City. Guess that would pay better than these Medina scabs. I offer to save their lives, and the best they can do is 12 credits. How about you make a reasonable offer and we get out of this hole? I've got things to do. I'll get back to you. How is, um, coffee business doing, by the way? I've seen the MG commercial. The endorsement of Pequod. Thanks a million. No what problem. What can I say? We all have our taste in coffee. Indeed. Huh. Smug arcology brat. I guess the situation in the arcology hasn't hurt business. Aren't you worried that the Templars might occupy the Medina? Hmm. What does it matter, as long as I have customers? I guess you're not very political. Nope. I have enough worries just getting profitable. The regional director is reviewing my books at the end of the week. My only enemy is Pequod, and our battlefield is the customer. Isn't the Pequods in the arcology closed? The manager was murdered, but the Pequods Corporation will find a way to keep a branch in Cairo. That is my fate. Oh dear. You should know something. Pequods and Queequegs are separate brands of the same coffee cha um, shop chain. There you are. You should know something. Pequods and Queequegs are separate brands of the same coffee shop chain. <laughs> you never know, I guess. I'm serious. I saw the proof in some legal documents I came across in Germany. Mm -hmm. You are certain of this? Yep. Hmm. That would explain why the board's praise about the NG endorsement was so guarded. Yep. You don't seem too overwhelmed. Probably not. My mind is already working. I think I see an opportunity, in fact. The Pequod's manager had a black market operation. I could cover it up and tell management I was merely protecting the reputation of the coffee industry. You'd be calling attention to yourself. Is that what you want? Yes, indeed. I want to stay on their radar. An ex-Pequod's employee told me the code to their safe. 34, 45, 1, 23. You look like the mercenary type. Maybe you'd like to slip into the arcology and empty it for me. Your payment would be the contents of the safe. Well, that's providing me with something to do. Hello! Both of us are targets here. We will work separately until the final phase of the operation. 
What do you expect me to do? Hmm. You will infiltrate the new Cairo Arcology. I will do the same and join you prior to the assault. If anyone's a glaring target for Templar Paladins, it's a biomodified commando like yourself. True. Then we agree to maintain the minimal threat profile until a crucial moment. What if I'd rather work alone? Mm. Our orders are to work together. We will destroy Paladin and return biomod technology to international regulation. Hmm. Tell Dumier yeah, he's gonna have to look for an assassin somewhere else. Tell Dumier yeah, he's gonna have to look for an assassin somewhere else. We're gonna have to kill else. this guy. My orders encompass that contingency as well. I will <laughs> I'm good. I'll take that as a slip in the face. Don't be a fool, Alex. Do you really think that the Dentons will have any use for you? That's asking for trouble. Oh! oh. Ooh. I did not expect a cloud of death. But hey, you dropped a mag rail and some ammo. It seems that the Illuminati is making one last grab for power. You must revive Paul, Alex. Apostle Corps needs a strong leader who can restore it to global prominence. The Illuminati only want to steal our research to increase their wealth and power. Apparently there was a bot in the mosque, which I think I could probably deal with. Let's go complete on this and just first deal with this. So one moment to uh, pretend to play with the Illuminati. I'm my own agent and I work for myself and other people. But you know, it was more than a slap. Hey, come down. It's a beautiful day for a walk. You know I can't. No more excuses about your grandfather. The plague is gone. Look at the sky. Mm -hmm. Don't be fooled by the wind. The dust always comes back. Not this time. They found a cure and reprogrammed the bot. They did. I found it. I'll ask grandfather. Oy. Ask for a new reason to be locked up for two years. No. Come. I am going. Oh, Ani, you're right. It's a beautiful day. Femi. Yes. At last. Love blossoms in all situations. Ah, fresh air. J.C. Denton has a hold on your imagination, perhaps. Talk to your friend Leo in front of the mosque. See how much he likes enforced modification. Do you really think Apostle Corps is any different than the saint of the Umar? Maybe. Hey, Omar. How you doing? I doubt you have much to sell me, but I will go and talk to uh, my good friend Leo. The mosque is... Is that Leo? Oh, remember when I said you might get modified? Hey. Leo, is that you? The frog suit threw me for a second. Alex, familiar face. Just what I need. I guess I don't have to ask whether you're still working for the Omar. Hmm. I've completed phase one of the Omar induction. He said I would have two months to decide whether to accept the cortical interface, which will make me a true Omar. But they are afraid the Templars will attack the Medina. They want me to undergo phase two immediately. Mm. Sounds like you're having second thoughts. Yeah. There's no turning back after phase two. I'd be almost invincible with cyborg hardware plus the Tarsus Biomod, but this stuff's not like a nanite infusion. I'm still sore from the transkeletal supports I already have. Just tell them you need time to think about it. I don't think you're gonna do they that. They say I have chosen. They say they will find me when I'm asleep and complete the operation. Then I will think like an Omar. It will be too late for choice. Oh dear. Maybe you should leave town. Yeah. No money. I'd have to go on foot. With thermal vision, they'd pick me out on the desert plain like a pilot beak. I have money. I have a lot of money. Well, you're the one who wanted to be such a badass. No, no, no. Let's give him some money. Let's help him get out. Here's some money for a pilot. You sure? Yep. Go ahead. Take it. I don't know what to say. Thanks, Alex. I'll pay you back. Double. If you want to pay me back, maybe you could find a pilot to take you to the Statue of Liberty in New York. Mm. What for? I think I'd find more work in Europe. There's something you don't know about the Tarsus experiments. Yes. Yeah? Go on. The experiments were started by J.C. Denton and his brother Paul. They wanted to develop a biomod architecture that they could distribute to everyone on the planet. Uh-huh. They'll probably make a bundle, too. So that's why they dropped out of sight? It's some sort of utopian vision they have. A society okay. based on absolute equality. Meanwhile, everyone wants a piece of the technology, including the Order and WTO, which are both puppets of the contemporary incarnation of the Illuminati, believe it or not. And of course, the Templars want to destroy it. A utopia of human-machine super-beings? Sounds familiar. 
Liberty Island is critical for J.C. Denton's plan. We'll find out more when we get there. Right. Like, I'm about to sign up with a guy who wants to mod people by force. If you ask me, I think you're dealing with crazies on all sides. Knights Templar? Do they really think they're knights or what? Illuminati? Who told you they were in the Illuminati? Well, show up in New York and maybe you can help me sort all of this out. Right. I think he's got a point. I won't forget this, Alex. No, didn't think you would. Don't worry. I'll figure out how to get to New York. I want to see what that's all about. Oh, yeah. I imagine you would. Yeah, you're right. This getup looks like a frog suit. Either I take up scuba diving or I find an implant surgeon who can remove it. Mmm. So much for making a big and organized crime. Yeah. Too bad I'm leaving this place just as the crud's getting vacuumed out of the air. Indeed. Too bad I'm leaving this place just as the crud's getting back. And lastly, I think we'll talk to this guy. Cheer up, the plague is gone. Alright. How about this before I go? Time again for a dog? Well, it's oh dear. In the bullseye today, Luminan Saman, formerly of the Order Church. So you've gone public with a new card game, I hear. What's it called? Uh... I'm the Templar Grandmaster. Ha. <laughs> Right, knights. <laughs> That's rich. Beat up a few defenseless bystanders and suddenly you're... He's being interrupted. They've declared open war. Today the Templars avenged themselves against Philip the Fair, who drove us underground nearly eight centuries ago. Is it so difficult to understand? Indeed. Hey, I'll ask the questions here. You're thugs and innocent people. <laughs> He's being interrupted. You will fall. Your culture has already disintegrated into flimsy tatters. We're merely sweeping the streets clean. <laughs> That's it. Cut the mic. Someone cut the... <laughs> your little blips of thought. <clears throat> it's indeed. You and your kind have murdered the human intellect with momentary impulses. The noise of the machine seeping into every mind. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm not gonna sit here and... Janice, what? Janice no longer works here. Mr. Steve, really? This is the last top bullet. Wow, that was awesome. Oh, wow, that's awesome. When we come back, folks, we'll uh, destroy the bot in the mask and ironically probably save the order people within, and then go to the ecology and save the people there and deal with Paul. Catch you later. See you then. Later.